Right, gents, listen to me. You both know the rules. Obey my command at all times. When I tell you to break, break cleanly. Step back, throw no punches. Keep your heads out of the way. Most importantly, protect yourself at all times. Shake hands. Something about big punching middleweights, isn't there? The British boxing public seem to love them. And Denzel Bentley seems to be another chip off that particular block. Eight stoppage wins in ten victories and undefeated so far. And he's got plenty of support here in this Second famous time. old Round arena ball. tonight. Let's see what he can make of Kelsey Ball. Well, he's going looking for him, absolutely oh. from word go. Well, can't miss ball there, but you've got to give ball credit. He's taking everything and trying to fight it back, but he needs to move his head a little bit here, ball. Oh, nice left hand there from, from Bentley. Ball trying to hold on for survival. Referee going to have a word here. You can't do that, dear boy. Just, just trying to get some order now early in the fight here. Before he gets out of control, the referee. Kieran McCann, the referee, speaking to both men. That's nice there from Bentley. Shot. Again, though, the chin on ball. Yeah, it took a big right hand, but these have got to be having some sort of cumulative effect. He's really throwing an awful lot in this opening round. Bentley trying to really unload. Ball looks like he's, he's thinking about firing back, but he's not, he's not looking to defend. I'll just keep taking something and I'm just looking to fire back at myself. Oh, God, the uppercut. Terrific right hand. And going looking for him again, and the referee's looking and he's finished it. He's stopped it. He's stopped it in the second minute of the opening round. And Denzel Bentley underlines the reputation that he's starting to form with another first round stoppage congratulated by martin bowers and ray bull his trainers from the peacock gym and this boy from battersea whatever you say about his style my goodness he goes for it well he's like it like most guys here in their career when they know they can punch they just go out there looking for blood looking to get out there early and listen he did the job there were some mistakes along the way there he shortened the distance a little bit and got caught himself but you know he just beat a guy here in ball who, who showed that he can take a great shot and just kept firing away you know i just think you know I and mean, then when he did at the end of the, at the end of just the, the finish there kept a bit of maintained a bit of distance so he gave him more leverage in his shots that's when ball just started to you know, wane and start just to fall forward a little bit that's a beautiful up there though, from, from, from bentley and he and he, he worked for that as well he turned that left shoulder there and then the punches come over the back of his head before he fired with that left uppercut not missing with much here either, Bentley, to his credit. 30 odd years ago, there was a young middleweight called Nigel Benn who used to go for opponents a bit like this. He did, well, how raw was Nigel Benn? Not many mistakes did he make, but got it. But ultimately, his power and aggression saw him through all those early fights, even some of the fights where he had some rocky moments. Well, in this very arena, he was in all sorts of trouble against a guy called Anthony Logan yeah. and came back and knocked him out and produce the sort of raw aggression that has uh, been demonstrated here tonight by Denzel Bentley. Here now, Terence Schreiber. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the official time. One minute, 12 seconds of round number one. Our referee in charge, Kieran McCann, steps in, stops the contest because the red corner was in no position to continue. Therefore, your winner and still undefeated, Denzel Too Sharp Bentley. The crowd like him. He's getting a tremendous...